both of the positions that make over a quarter million dollars a year. Chief engineer on a container ship, um, law firm partner, and there was one more. It was a director, senior product design director. All of these people are making over a quarter million dollars a year, but all of these people are trading in a significant amount of their time in order to do so. They get into the bag. But I got to congratulate them, though, because at least they're not sitting here running around in the victim Olympics. At least they're not sent. Yo. And they said that's part time. No, I don't care what it is. They got to literally take their clothes off, degrade themselves, make it clap. Deal with unruly dudes. Dudes probably smoking and blowing smoke in their face and on their butt and in their coochie all day. And you sitting here, that makes sense? Nah. I don't give a piss what part-time is. Not having it. How much people are making. We're just going to go straight on down the line. And then we're going to land right in the Sydney Carter's lap. <laughs> How much people are making. Would you like to know? People are sharing more than ever what they're actually making. And there's a BuzzFeed article out there in which people are sharing how much they actually make. And it's eye opening, I guess, because we have the anonymity, uh, anonymity, nimity, mati, t. I guess because we now have the anonymity, anonymity, anonymity. I guess now that we have the anonymity, I got it of the Internet. Say that fast three times. Of the internet, people feel comfortable sharing how much they make. Now, I think that the list is a little bit weird because I went through some of these. I think that the list is a little bit weird simply because we don't have location added into it. But I, I, I find it interesting, and I think that y'all actually liked us going over this last time because we did this a couple times before. So I want to share with you guys what people are making and then we can have that conversation really quick hit about whether or not you should get that basket weaving degree or not. Uh, King Music says um, about to buy a second car, but I refuse to overpay for it. Have patience, my friend. Ain't no need in overpaying for something that you don't have to overpay for. Shout out to King Music. I appreciate the 10 ball, my friend. Let's get it. All right. So let me share this article with you guys. Um, and this comes courtesy of BuzzFeed. Okay. Um, of a rising store worker. We're going to go down a list. And y'all tell me where y'all fall in this. I'm checking the chat and seeing what the, what the next thing is. Verizon store worker. I work for an authorized retailer for, Ver for Verizon. And they make around $40,000 a year. Now, most people saying that's around the average salary of most people is between forty and fifty thousand dollars a year. So that's right there. I don't think that you need a college degree to work at a Verizon authorized store. I could be wrong. A donor database worker, whatever that is. I work on the donor database for a large regional hunger relief nonprofit. Hey, y'all stay away from these nonprofits unless you already got the bag. Let me say that again. Y'all stay away from these nonprofits unless you already got the bag because we don't give a piss about your purpose. F your feelings. We only care about securing that money. All right. Um, I pull in forty five, basically forty four five thousand dollars a year. Um, and they took away bonuses for non exempt employees. Do y'all know what exempt and non exempt employees are? We we'll get into that in a minute. Auto and home insurance. Uh, auto and home homeowners insurance sales. In Colorado, I make $56,000 a year, almost three years experience, no degree, potential bonus up to 12%, usually ends up around 8%, $56,000 a year. So that's really average. I was uh, coaching a guy yesterday and we had a good laugh. I told him I was going to share this with the people. Obviously, I'm, not, I'm never going to share um, who it is or anything like that. And uh, he said, Anton, I said, what is your degree in, fam? Because we was talking about his profession and things like that. He said, I got an acting degree. <laughs> I bust out laughing. I said, what? He said, I got an acting degree. I said, oh, no, Freaky Jason. Oh, no, Freaky Jason. Um, Let's continue. SSDI, Supplemental Secondary Income, Basically Disability um, making $14,000 a year. I frequently have the choice to have to make the choice between eating or being able to afford pre prescription medication. <clears throat> I know people that's desperate to go on 
um, disability. They would rather lower the amount of money that they're making, not get to the bag just so they don't have to work and they can get free money. I know people that actually chase disability. That's insane. Teachers aid at an elementary school. I make about $20,000 prior to that. I, I worked at a locally owned vet hospital for eight years and made about $18,000, including overtime with no benefits. Oh, we. Oh, we. Rebuke that. Rebuke poverty level. Oh, no. Um, restaurant general manager in Michigan. I make about $60,000 with benefits. A re restaurant general manager in Michigan make about $60,000 in benefits. Speaking of restaurants, I'm actually, um, so I'm a silent investor in a few different restaurants, right? I've been able to lend my expertise in some of these businesses. I'm thinking about creating another one that's a little bit more visible, but the problem is that there's a worker issue. I'm thinking that that might subside very soon. But um, putting up another hundred and fourteen thousand dollars of my own money, maybe we're gonna document the whole journey. If I do, Rita's adamantly against it, but she's not here right now, so she can't tell me what to do. So we gonna go ahead and do what we want to do. All right, let's continue, ladies and gentlemen. Um, senior product design director. Now we get into the money. This is right up what I keep telling y'all to get into. I showed y'all my W two. If you're not a part of the Patreon, let me let me do this. If you're not a part of the Patreon, I show you my W-2 from when I actually took a job and I started working at a regular gig back in September of 2021. I showed my W-2 on the Patreon and then I'm giving you the game on how it is that you can level up. Subscribe to the Patreon. Link is in the description as well as pinned to the top, uh, pinned to the top of the chat. There's no excuses. No excuses. Senior product design director is making $282,000 a year. Um, an accountant, hold on, check this out. I'm in the Seattle area and his salary is 282,000. If you're making at least a quarter million dollars a year, which is the equivalent of 25, well, a little less than $25,000 a month. Um, a little more than $20,000 a month. If you're making somewhere in the, in the, in the settings between 20 and $25,000 a month, that's when life starts to really take off for you. That's when you can really shake and move and you got to move some money around and you can make some moves. But life really starts to take off at around twenty five thousand dollars a month. Now, for some of you and let me have this heart to heart with some of y'all. For some of you, you're going to sit here and you're going to whine and complain and you're going to say, well, I'm just happy to hit six figures. That's just a talking point. Six figures is only the equivalent of sixty seven thousand dollars after taxes. If you're a single person living in any major city, sometimes it can go up to a little bit short of $70,000, but it's not a lot of money. You got to fund your retirement, which I encourage you to max out. That's at least $20,500. So now you've already been reduced to $47,000 or $46,500. I can do a little bit of math. You got to take care of your kids, which are expensive. You want to go on vacation? Cool. Some of y'all want to have a hot girl summer? Awesome. You got to pay for living expenses. They say don't give any more than 30% of your income. You see how it starts to dwindle down? If you just want to survive and hopefully be able to retire, then go ahead and shoot for six figures. Inflation is going to kill that in a few years. We got to aim higher. We got to continue to grow higher. We got to continue to move very intentionally in its ways in which you can do it and it's not hard to do but you have to be intentional on how it is that you move it i digress let's go ahead and finish the quick hit an accountant uh entry level accountant no experience graduated with degrees in accounting and finance a little over sixty thousand dollars no no um no overtime high school art teacher um in an expensive northern state which means that they probably can't even afford to really stay there make just shy of sixty thousand dollars a year before taxes have to work Two after school teaching jobs and they pay about $30 an hour in order to pay their bills. A high school art teacher. Welding engineer. I'm in Detroit starting salary 65. Eight years later, they had $100,000 a year. That's what we used to be chasing when we wanted to work in the plants in Detroit. Car salesperson. I made $170,000. Shout out to my salespeople. 
I dropped a video about the importance of sales and what it is that you need to work on and focus on. If you checked out the video on the Patreon about sales, it's a very important video that you need to watch. I give you my five things that you need to focus on as far as making sure that you cultivate your sales acumen. And guess what? All of us are in sales and we don't even know it. Sydney Carter is in sales. I'll explain it to you later. $170,000 in 2021 as a car salesperson. Insane. Absolutely insane. Law firm partner. Been practicing law for over 10 years. 10 years, I earn about $800,000 a year plus bonuses and incentives. We have excellent health and dental coverage. I get roughly three to four weeks of vacation. Of course, I work long hours. Rarely any weekends are free. And they're expected to bill at least 60 hours a week, meaning that they have to they have to work weekends. And this is the myth, I think, that comes along with certain um, things that we do. People always say, Anton, why do you work so much? Because I want to make at least two million dollars this year. And that two million ain't going to make itself. I want to make at least two million take home this year. And that million is not going to make itself. They make 800000 after 10 years. I coach some lawyers. This is not out of the realm of possibility. 800 bands after 10 years. That ain't no basket weaving degree. Civil engineer. Uh, living relatively low cost. Um, part of the U.S. Seven years experience and a master's. And without bonuses or OT, they make at least $85,000 a year. That's without overtime or bonuses. Typically adds another three to $5,000, sometimes more. OT is typically not much extra since they rarely work over OT. Um, general manager, this one is funny. General manager at Panda Express. I don't want to hear nobody making excuses. They said they made $106,000 this year. Where Panda Express at? Listen, listen, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me tap in real quick. If y'all sitting here, look at that man at Panda Express. If y'all sitting here telling me that you broke, bro. You broke, bro. And they over there giving away 100. I see bonuses all up and down the street. $5,000 sign a bonus. Just stay for a month. $6,000 stay, stay, uh, sign a bonus. Just stay for a month. You ain't got nothing but time. You don't have anything but time. The economy, as far as jobs, are booming. There is no reason for any grown man that's above the age of 21. My nephews aren't even 21 yet, and them dudes are making almost $100,000 a year. If you sitting here telling me you can't go out and get 100, 100 bands, now what you do with it is a completely different conversation, and you need to join the Patreon for that. Link is in the description as well as pinned to the top of the chat. But if you're not out here getting at least 100 bands and you a grown man, we got issues. We have issues. There is no reason for you not to be able to get 100 bands. And that's light. That's light work. I just, honest to God, on my father's grave, I coached a guy yesterday and he called me. It was his second call. His second call. He said, Anton, I just want to thank you. Honest to God, on my dead father's grave. He said, Anton, I just want to thank you. I said, what's going on, family? He said, since we talked, I accepted this new offer that you pushed me towards. I'm making $20,000 more than what I was making prior to us starting talking in this coaching session. It's no reason why y'all should not be getting 100 bands. Real talk. <sighs> Jesus, y'all frustrating me. Stop making excuses and start getting to the bag. Man, $106,000 this year at Panda Express has amazing benefits, including insurance, 401k scholarships, free meals. He said free meals. Throw that in there. Panda Express has a bonus structure that allows general managers to make amazing money. Amazing. Look at that man. Next time you go into a Panda Express and that man say, "Have I take? can I take your order? Just remember, he might be making more to you. Don't turn your nose up at that man. That man get into his bag. Sighted teacher. What the F is a sighted teacher? Oh, okay. Sighted teacher teaching blind adults technology. Been there for 19 years, making $19 an hour. Have benefits in retirement, not long until retirement. This is the type of job where people is just working to retire. They're not thriving. They're not excited about life. They wake up, they do what they got to do, and they work into, they're living to die. 
Oh, check it out. They got Exotic Dancer on the list. I'm an exotic dancer in a West Virginia town. I was over in West Virginia. Average $300 on an eight-hour shift, three days a week, and make anywhere from 43. That ain't enough, baby girl. You out here like uh, Diamond from the Players Club, and you only making uh, $300? You making all of that shake for $300? $300. And you pulling a full eight hours? And you making a clap? Wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. She said, I make an average of $300 on an eight-hour eight shift. Clearly, this ain't King of Diamonds. Three days a week, make anywhere from forty-three dollars to $55,000 a year. Baby girl, baby girl, I'm going to need you to go ahead and quit and raise your standards. Jesus Christ. Uh, chief engineer on a container ship. $250,000 a year for about six months worth of work. Six months of work is seven days a week, 24 hours a day on call, on a ship, or or sea, or in a port. So both of the positions that make over a quarter million dollars a year. Chief engineer on a container ship, um, law firm partner, and there was one more. It was a director. Senior product design director. All of these people are making over a quarter million dollars a year, but all of these people are trading in a significant amount of their time in order to do so. They get into the bag. But I got to congratulate them, though, because at least they're not sitting here running around in the victim Olympics. At least they're not sent. Yo. And they said that's part time. No, I don't care what it is. They got to literally take their clothes off, degrade themselves, make it clap. Deal with unruly dudes. Dudes probably smoking and blowing smoke in their face and on their butt and in their coochie all day. And you sitting here, that makes sense? Nah. I don't give a piss what part-time is. Not having it. 